I am therefore glad that the Committee of Ministers used its powers and the Convention to seek the release of Ilga Mamado. A judgment from this court made clear that his, that his detention was flawed, yet he remained in prison for several years. Ultimately, our organization took the action required. This included my use of Article 52 of the Convention, and at my request, the Committee of Ministers first ever deploy, uh, deployed Article 46.4. I have no doubt that this played a major role in the eventual decision to end Mr. Mamado's detention, and it sent a powerful signal to all member states.